What's good, beautiful people? It's Okoshin Tal here, back again with another lit video featuring us for the first time. Welcome, and if you are returning, thank you so much for tuning back in. So, you guys have read by today's title, and today I have a winter fashions trends to follow for 2020. So, without any further ado, let's get into the video. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to join the family, and I'll see you guys in my next upload. Okay, so the very first trend that I am going to be talking about is the sweatpants trend. Okay, a lot of people love sweatpants, and I love sweatpants. I have a pair of grey sweatpants, but I'm trying to grow my sweatpant inventory. I don't know what I'm trying to say, but you you know what I mean. You can never go wrong with sweatpants. You can style them up or down, any colors, especially if they're like a staple color. But I would like like to um go into different colors board colors colors that are out there because i'm a very neutral girl and sometimes it can be boring another chain that i'm looking forward to is the mini skirt chain i know if i'm like in winter yes honey in winter <laughs> in the winter okay you can style it with um stockings um knee high boots and then turtleneck sweaters jackets whatever just as long as you're warm and no cold formed against your shop prosper period <laughs> And the next chain that I'm definitely going to be, the next chain that I'm definitely going to be following is the knee high boot chain. I don't have knee high boots, which is kind of sad because I like heels, and most knee high boots come in heels, and I don't have that. But I would like for my first pair to be black because you can style it up or down with boots. Um, you can style it in summer even. I've seen people style it in summer. You can style it with um jeans, mini skirts, whatever you want, honey. You can never go wrong. I don't think sweatpants and knee high boots will look good together i don't know i don't know <laughs> i don't know but the next trend that i am going to be following is this trend that i recently saw okay people are turning oversized hoodies or sweaters into dresses and i'm like y'all never put me on like <sighs> but it's okay i'm here to put the lid squat on <laughs> so i am definitely going to be buying sweaters and hoodies from the main size from the main section because I feel like their sizes are more of like a bigger cut and it will become the perfect oversized sweater or hoodie or anything like that and definitely going to be wearing it with a jacket on top just to you know complete the look with um knee high boots jewelry mini bag you know the vibes <laughs> and the next trend that I am going to be talking about is the long jacket trend okay a lot of people don't like long jackets but I have a thing for long jackets blazers I'm there I'm the girl <laughs> so I am definitely going to be using my mom's actually I am going to start by comforting myself into it by using my mom's long jackets and then I will eventually you know go through shopping because I do understand that long jackets are actually quite expensive so I will go through shopping and try to find something on, more on the affordable side because I am a beginner when it comes to long jackets and I'm not trying to buy something expensive and I don't like it <laughs> anyways the next trend that I am going to be following is the graphic hoodie. Okay, hoodies are cute. Graphic ones, y'all, y'all don't understand. Like, graphic hoodies are just so cute. Like, you can wear a graphic hoodie, a jean, sneakers, and your seat. That's it. That, that, nothing else, that's it. Period. <laughs> and then, I do want to say that this trend, I I don't think it's a trend, I feel like it's a normality, but some people don't know about it. When you put on a hoodie, and then you put a jean jacket or a leather jacket on top, that's just so cute, and paired with jeans and sneakers, oh my gosh, that is so adorable. Also, if you wear sneakers, jeans, and a sweater, that's it, that's a look. Period. You're done. Finish. Bar. <laughs> Anyways. The next trend that I am going to be following is the bomber jacket trend. Honey, I love bomber jackets, but I hardly ever wear bomber jackets outside because I don't know. I don't, they're colorful, okay? They're colorful, and like I said, I'm a very neutral girl, so I am scared to wear them outside, but I'm going to try my best to wear bomber jackets. So. <laughs> y'all better follow me on Instagram so y'all can see the outfits that I'm about to pull off. Honey. It's gonna be winter, but I'm gonna be bringing the heat in winter. <laughs> the next um, trend that I'm going to be following is the teddy coats. Teddy coats have been trending for quite a long. <clears throat> teddy <laughs> coats have been trending for quite a long time now. I don't have one, so I'm very, very impatient to get one. I feel like there's no one in my circle who actually has a teddy coat, so I want to be the first one. <laughs> Checkmate. <laughs> but yeah, I am definitely getting a teddy coat. 
and i feel like okay so my last chain that i'm going to talk about is jewelry okay i am a very slow girl when it comes to jewelry i always forget to put on jewelry i forget to put on my necklaces my rings my watches i have so many of those but i just forget so i am going to try and um move into jewelry in that type of way oh wait i forgot a chain another chain a very popular famous winter chain it a popular famous winter trend is actually layering clothes okay people layer clothes all the time it can either go good or it can go south so you better be careful with that because sometimes people want to play with um tones textures colors materials cuts and all of that i feel like i am missing out another trend another trend that i'm going to be following is the monochromatic look okay pretty simple just monochrome that's it you can never go wrong with monochrome i feel like well you can but it's, it's very hard to go wrong with monochrome other than that that's all the chains that i have today if you guys would like a part two to this make sure to tell me in the comment section down below also give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it don't forget to follow me on all my social media pages it's gentle content absolutely everywhere and i'll see you guys in my next upload